in oh, this case, people will be looking at this woman forever. I think some people will and say, "Oh, she's the mother of yeah, that she man must, that did yeah, that atrocity." No. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I know, sadly, I know a few people who lost their uh, children or partners to suicide. Mm. And again, they go, "Why didn't I recognize something? Why couldn't I see something was wrong? Why couldn't they come to me and tell me what the problem was?" So I think I that must think be so terrible suicide, <clears throat> particularly if people haven't left a note with any kind of yeah. explanation, and you're just left never knowing what could I have done what, yeah. what they were thinking why or why did they uh, that... feel they couldn't talk to me I'm their mom mm -hmm. or you know am I so bad that I never gave them that opportunity to talk mm. to me you know it's like with this lady here she'll be thinking did I not bring him up to be mentally strong enough not to fall into that mm. trap of being brainwashed into that way of thinking you know it's just Ooh. I was made to feel like so guilty with my mum. Like I always remember, like my mum and dad, they you know they held the hand right, each other's hand right till the very end, and they were the epitome of of love, of being in love for their you know years and years and years of marriage. You know, thirty eight years they were together, and I. You know, I met someone. It was all over the papers. A very very failed relationship, and. You know, it should have stopped and I should have listened to my mum. But she basically took me to one side and she said, I'm blaming myself because you've seen, you know, everything in, in her and dad that, that, that she loathed. She was so moralistic, you know. She believed in true love and the romance and, and that I should never, ever, ever have done what I didn't and I will forever hate myself mm. for it, you know, but she, she said, she completely took the blame herself and said, you know, why do you not want to emulate me and dad? Mm. And, and how did that make you feel? Horrendous. Yeah, really horrendous. And, and that actually was the, the catalyst that made me go, you know what, I'm wrong with it. So with they a felt responsible for your actions? Absolutely, because I wasn't brought up that way. Mm. You know, I was brought up that, you know, you are with that man, you're with the man, mm. you know, till the day you die. But you do hear parents, don't you, when you hear them being interviewed, if their child has got into any kind of trouble, they say, we didn't bring him or her up, up that way. That we way, didn't bring yes. them up to think but that. But then yeah. I also yeah. think there are bad pennies sometimes too. You could have the best family and the best upbringing for all your oh, children completely. and there'll just be a bad penny.